So God made a Granger. I need somebody to grow personally, develop character, build confidence, and promote leadership skills. I need the family to be one of the cornerstones on which the Grange is built. Family values will be promoted, taught, and woven into all Grange activities and events. The Grange will serve as a safe environment for every member of the family from newborns to great-grandparents. So God made a Granger. God had to have a structure that allows for everyone to have an equal voice to nurture skills and values through the Junior Grange as early as age five. God said, I need adults to serve as mentors and leaders for our junior and youth members. Leaders who allow children to have fun, participate in activities, learn leadership roles and responsibilities and make a difference in their communities. So God made a Granger. God said, I need somebody to commit to issue-based grassroots processes which allow us to support civic leaders based on policy and strongly encourage our membership to engage in local politics and elections that can, better, that can better their communities they live in. So God made a Granger. I need somebody to enjoy working with the next generation who will carry the spirit of America forward. Community leaders who will encourage families to band together to promote the economic and political well-being of the community and agriculture. So God made a Granger. God said, I need somebody to have the opportunity to be leaders in the Grange, to step outside their comfort zone and become more confident in their public speaking and their ability to lead, to, be to develop lasting friendships with people all around the country. So God made a Granger. I need somebody to be engaged as rural and agriculture advocates, to be the vo voice of rural America's communities across the United States. Somebody to be a store for the land, care for the animals, and provide food for our tables. I need somebody to prepare the dough for chicken pot pie dinners. <laughs> somebody to provide programs to lo local nursing homes, to be counselors at our <coughs> summer camps, and someone to make a positive difference in their communities. So God made a Granger. God said, I need good citizens with strong morals, people children can look up to as role models. I need somebody to follow the motto, in essentials, unity, and non-essentials, liberty, and in all things, charity. So God made a Granger. God said, I need all generations to come together, to learn from one another and build a strong America one community at a time. I need the family and community to be the foundation of the Grange. I need a place for people of all ages to get, to, to get connected. So God made a Granger. A special thank you to Paul Harvey for presenting the original speech, So God Made a Farmer, in 1978. When I first heard this speech, it gave me goosebumps. I truly am glad God made a Granger through the assistance and preservation of the seven founding fathers of over 146 years ago. The Grange has made me the person I am today. The Grange has touched my life in many positive ways, building my leadership skills, public speaking abilities, and developing my character. Yes, I am very glad God made me a Granger. Thank you.